Honest, J. Nowak. Oh yeah. A pleasure to meet y'all at last, and welcome back to Honest J. Nowak. And so what I'm going to do here on Honest J. Nowak is that I'm actually going to be talking a little bit about vehicle scales. Yes, vehicle scales. Apparently people out there just don't seem to care how much a vehicle weighs nowadays. That's why in some places, especially in dumps or recycling plants or otherwise, and some businesses around actually do require you to put your vehicle on a vehicle scale. And this would be to ensure that probably the parking lot doesn't get damaged more than it is already. Or if there are certain parts of the road that can actually be broken down by a certain vehicle's weight. I guess it's something out there that happens to be an okay idea. But I suppose that it's not always necessary. Because the fact is, is that not every car out there is more than three tons. Not every car out there. There's many cars out there that aren't even a single ton in terms of weight. So, I mean, that probably should have been something that should not be looked over as often. But, of course, the idea of having more and more and more stuff being put on your car to increase its weight in total would allow for it to have to be put onto a scale just to ensure that a certain road that needs to be fixed up or something like that doesn't get damaged. But I suppose it might become a little bit of an annoying task because... What if I'm like late for work or something like that, and if there are certain places I'd have to go to before then? I wouldn't want to have to put my vehicle on a scale if I'm simply just throwing stuff away. I'm not really trying to ruin your roads, people who are actually working for some of these businesses that I've labeled out already. But again, I'm actually fine with the idea that a vehicle would need to be weighed just so nothing wrong could happen with the road that a certain car or truck is being traveled on, but it's still a bit of a boring and annoying type of task that has to be performed in a lot of ways. Toll boots, on the other hand, though, are not something that really needs to be ignored upon. Everybody has to put in a certain amount just for people to pay for the road construction or for architecture work, all that good other stuff. But again, vehicle scales are not something that needs to be put in as often as it is now. We're not always going to be seeing a lot of things going on around that part. So people out there who are driving trucks, people out there who are driving really heavy vehicles out there like conversion vans or heavy duty pickups, any of that sort out there, hopefully you'll see this episode and you'll see why vehicle scales can be an annoying and kind of a boring task. A bit tedious in a way. So the end, again... This is kind of just another short level subject that I'd probably touch up on, but that's only because I like to get them out of the way as quickly as possible. So, with each episode, I'd probably get from like two minutes to nine minutes at a time, and that seems to be okay by me. Hopefully not shorter, not longer. But still, there's going to be a lot of other things I'm going to be talking about here in the season alone. It's going to be a really long journey here, and so... If you want to see more, go down to my channel. Make sure that you like, subscribe, comment, follow me on social media, and stay on the Hollywood side.